on any electronic, it needs to read the correct information. So if you're on there and it says, let, let's say produce case is running at 38 degrees, uh, but you go down there and they're losing product or because, because it's too cold, but the sensor's reading 38 degrees, well, then it's the computer is just doing what it's told. So it's very important. Those inputs on that board are exactly reading what it's supposed to be. So you have to verify that. I love that. I love that because I've been hearing and seeing more and more people trying to troubleshoot just from the controller. So they're up playing on the microthermal, the E2, Danfa, and they're trying to fix the problem that is more of a mechanical or a electrical issue that you can't fix that way. You have to go out and take a temperature probe that reads accurately. So you get your temperature probe, you put it in ice water, make sure it reads 32 or zero, and then you go and verify that that temperature probe. I think that is key. And what you said there is that uh, if you don't verify it, you're gonna get yourself into potentially more trouble.